Welcome to the channel. In this video, we will see how we can compile and run a C program using the command prompt and a simple text editor in Windows 10 operating system. Now, in order to continue with this video, you need to download and install MinGW, that is the minimalist GNU for Windows in your Windows machine so that you get access to the GCC toolset in Windows. And also you need to set the path enrollment variable. If you don't know about this, then I have already made a video and explained everything in detail. So if you want, you can watch that video. The link will be in the description box. The first thing that I'm going to do is I'm going to open up a simple text editor available. I have a notepad available in my computer. So I'm going to open it up. And here we will write a simple C program. Now here I have written a simple C program, which will display hello world to the screen. Now, after writing this code, we will go to file and we will go to save. And uh, I'm going to save this uh, file in my desktop. And uh, I want to store it in my desktop inside another folder. So I'm going to go to new and uh, I'm going to create a folder. Let us say coding. You know, you can give any name. And after that, I'm going to double click on this folder and open it up. And here I need to save the file. So I'm going to use a double quote here. And then between these double quotes, I'm going to type in, let us say, hello dot C. Uh, if you don't use the double quotes here, then you can uh, select the all files extension in here, you know, instead of that text file and it will work. Now, after that, click on save. And here you guys can see the file is saved. Now I'm going to close this file. And uh, here you guys can see the folder that I have created coding is present. If I open it up, then here is the C file that I have created uh, in your computer. The icon may be different. That's okay because I have installed Visual Studio code here and that is the default editor for, you know, supported file types. So uh, that's why, you know, it is uh, showing this icon here. Now, the next thing that we do is we will uh, open up the command prompt in this folder. To do that, a simple trick is just go to this URL section part to the folder and click on there and it will highlight the path and just type in cmd and hit the enter button now if you look at it then here the command prompt is opened with this folder so it is my desktop and then this coding folder now here if i use the dir command then you guys can see the files and folders present in this folder which is hello.c now in order to compile and run a C program using the command prompt, we will type in GCC. That's because I have installed GCC and then a space. And then I need to type in the file name, which is hello.c. And if I do that, just watch out this folder here. If I hit the enter button, then you guys can see another file is created in this uh, folder and that is called as a. Here, since I have not given any name for the uh, executable file to be generated, it, you know, it has chosen the default name, which is A. So now if I want to run this program, I just have to type in A and hit the enter button. And you guys can see hello world here in this screen. If you want to give a name for the executable file generated, then you can do that. And for that, while compiling the program, we can uh, provide the name. So I'm going to write in GCC and then we need to use minus wo. Uh, it is for saying that, you know, I'm, I want to give a name for the output file and then we have to specify the name that we want to give. So in this case, let us say hello.exe because it will be an executable file. And after that, add a space and then write in the file name, which is hello dot c so gcc minus o hello dot exe that will be the name for the executable file which will be generated and then the source file containing the c program and after that if i hit the enter button you guys can see in this folder a file is created with the name hello it is an executable file exe file now if i want to run this program then I can type in just the uh, name of the executable file, which is hello. And if I hit the enter button, you guys can see we get hello world, which is the output of the program. So this is how you can simply compile and run a C program 
in Windows 10 command prompt. If you like it, hit the like button. If you don't like it, hit the dislike button. If you want to say something, then write that in the comment box. For more tutorials like this, do subscribe to the channel. Thank you for watching. I'll see you later in the next video.